Hi, uh, I'm Joel Lumsden. Um, I'm head of SEO for Attica Internet Marketing. Um, we work with a number of companies uh, actually attending the ASSC conference um, on their online marketing efforts, um, including Wilderness Scotland, the ASSC itself, uh, Embrace Scotland, um, and a few others. Um, we're kind of involved in all areas of online marketing, so that's search engine optimization, paid search, um, social media, everything kind of integrated together. Um, and generally, it, it kind of brings together all aspects of, of, of what people are doing uh, in their online presences to try and help them gain more customers. Generally, our, our expertise uh, at ATCAT is in uh, so SEO and, and internet marketing. Um, we obviously have uh, a lot of uh, a lot of kind of wealth of knowledge uh, in that area, and it's uh, a kind of rapidly changing uh, industry and a rapidly changing area where it's very hard to keep up with the latest findings. So, what we try and do is help the uh, people we work with um, know the best practice uh, and to keep them kind of safe um, for any future algorithm changes or, or changes in Google. Um, kind of top tips, I should say, um, at the moment is. Uh, Something that's been covered at the conference uh, and a little bit today is very much mobile focus as well. Um, lots of interesting stats um, in terms of the, the, the vast majority, or the vast, sorry, the vast rise uh, in mobile traffic, um, and especially uh, in the industry, this in terms of uh, rise in number of people making direct bookings, travel bookings uh, through mobile. But also, actually, there's a, an interesting stat that um, this year is supposed to be the first year that the volume of uh, desktop traffic actually falls. Um, so it's been cannibalized, it's been taken up by, by mobile traffic. So it's an area you, you absolutely need to be considering. Um, it's absolutely the way it's going. Um, so in terms of mobile first consideration, it comes into everything you do is the site that you have, does that work well on a mobile? Can someone book on a mobile? Are there kind of booking issues? Can you not press a button on a mobile? Something like that. The pictures you've got, the images, do they work on a mobile? Do they load quickly? Just thinking about everything you do, does it work on a mobile first? And also, does it when then work on desktop afterwards? Um, in terms of kind of other tips that we're going for, very much following on from that, it's content. We've talked about content, but it's content that helps you build a brand. Um, brand is incredibly important to, to search engines and to Google. That's what they want to rank. You'll see the big guys that you'll know of Booking.com and uh, TripAdvisor. They rank because people. Well, people want them to rank. They're a recognizable name, and these are the types of things they expect to see up there. So actually, the, the way that you need to, to, to act to get yourself to these top positions and to these places is, is to become a brand. You can be a small brand. There's no wrong with being a small, kind of feisty little brand, but you need these signals that mark you out as a brand. So that's consistent messaging. It's actually engaging with a very specific audience, uh, providing the types of content keyword themed, topic themed, that they want within that market. And then going out say, to the right people, so actually targeting them, outreaching, speaking to the, the people who publish in your area, to your intended audience. That's going to be the way that you really build your brand and build your kind of relevance towards a, a particular community. Concentrate on, on content is, is, is a difficult thing. Um, it's a difficult thing for lots of people to, to kind of fathom and get their heads around. We've seen some really impressive content today with the, the guys at Wilderness in their video content. Yes, it's an investment and it is, that can be you know, a significant investment to some of the smaller guys here. Not everyone can maybe do that, but you do need to be making an investment of some sort, even if it's on a smaller scale. So actually, you know, be thinking about who is your audience. Very, you know, be very targeted and think who are the types of people you want, what are the types of things they want to see, and whereabouts they hang out essentially online, or at least who are the people um, that can access them. And be very much tailoring your message to that. It can be small bits of content, but as long as it's very tailored and very useful, you have the opportunity to get out to these people who share it more. And that takes us into the kind of social media side. Don't get too flustered about being on such and such platform, being on Twitter, being on Facebook. Just be where your target audience wants to see you. Um, and that should be your primary consideration.